a gallon of gadget from Jean Benedict's ideasin5.com. Jean churns butter, makes tutti frutti ice cream, and more. It's your choice, a manicure or churning butter. The modern woman churns butter. Any guesses as to what this piece of machinery is? It spins, it's got blades, it's a flying machine. Actually, many of you probably already know or have guessed that this is an antique hand-cranked butter churn jar. And millions of homes from the 1800s up until the 1960s had jars like this and they used it to turn cream into butter. Actually, in the 60s, they were motorized, but you know what? I'm going to put my modern muscle to the test of this antique piece of machine and see if I can measure up to my grandmother's. So this has a screw top that comes off and it's got two blades on it, which tells me it's later than 1936. So I've got two quarts of cream and I'm going to churn away. <laughs> Here we go. And it's today's woman versus yesterday's machine. Here we go. Woo! It's like a washing machine or something. Check back with me later. Got a craving from the past? Make that food fast. To whip up Tutti Frutti ice cream, start with some strawberries and slice them up. Add a half cup each of maraschino cherries, walnuts, raisins, and strawberries all together into a jar. And fill it up with sherry. Put a lid on it and let it soak overnight. Then pour out the sherry and add the ingredients to vanilla ice cream. Mix that up and put it back in the freezer to firm up and enjoy. And that's Tutti Frutti ice cream. And now, frozen minted pear soda. Pop open a can of pear halves and heavy syrup, scoop out the pears into a freezer-friendly container, and freeze them. Pour the syrup into a bowl, cover, and refrigerate until you need it. Add fresh mint into a tall glass, frozen pear halves, pear syrup, and sparkling water or seltzer. And you've got frozen minted pear soda. Okay, I've been churning now for about 30 minutes and I have got nothing that looks like it would spread all over a stack of pancakes and be delicious. This poor little butter turner probably thought it was going to live out its life on a shelf with the other collectibles and here I am working it and it is working my arm. Okay, whipped cream yes, butter no. I'm sorry grandma, I'll uh, I'll try harder next time. I'm just gonna go to the store and pick up a stick.